Hello and welcome Crips here yet again and what are we doing today? Today I'm going to show you a pretty cool feature how you can transport or transfer one project on one computer to another computer. In other words, if you're working on a project and you need to take it to work, you can then continue doing it at work. So how do we do this? Well, very simple. Let's say you are working on a footage, you got different clips and different timelines, you got audio, you got the whole nine yards and you need all this all this and you want to transfer it or take it with you to work so it's very simply done actually if I uh, if I do this it almost looks like a, a Benny Hill cartoon doesn't it or Benny Hill cartoon. Hmm. anyway so what do we do all right well we're going to file and you'll see here it's smart package and so you just click on it once so first off it will ask you do you want to save it if you haven't done so already you say yes I want to save this all right, and then the path, and I'm just going to drop it straight onto my desktop, and I'm just going to call it Smart is the name of the folder, and the project file is probably Smart Test. Okay, now I have two options here. I can just create a folder, or I can zip it. So if it's a very large file, I can then zip it, and if I do zip it, and I'll show you in a minute, well, I'll show you now, right? Why wait a minute? So I'll press uh, Zip, and OK, and voila. Okay, so if you want to spread it over multiple CDs, in case you're doing it on a CD, you can do so here, like so. Uh, if you want to encrypt the files, you can do that as well, and that gives you a password. So whoever has, or whoever you're giving the work to, then needs also your password. It just just backs it up. And you know what? I'm not going to do that, so I'm just going to cancel that. And I'm going to cancel that as well, because I don't want to zip it for now. Uh, I just basically want to show you the smart package again. Yes, we've already saved it. Uh, it's all in here. Uh, whatever, smart test. And okay, so let's just do that. All right, so it's been saved. If I go to my folder, here it is, the smart. Open it up. Let's bring that over here. And you'll see my project here. These are all the files that associate with the project. And this is the VSP project itself. So... Basically, what it's done, it's gone through your computer. No matter where these, where these, blah, I'll start that again, shall I? It doesn't matter where these video files are located on your computer. The program or Video Studio locates them and makes a copy of them for you in a folder, which you can then transport to another computer. Hey, I'm going to hit the gym. Can you do me a favor? Uh, render this out and then upload it to YouTube for me. Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay, sweet. Okay. Right, so now that you have successfully transferred the project to another computer, it's just as simple as two clicks, I guess. Open up the folder and just double click on the VSP project and it will automatically load everything into the timeline for you. There you go. Now also, if you wish to bring in the files, just Control A everything and then drag it into your project like so. And voila, now you've got all the files attached as well. And that, my friends, is how you can move your projects between two computers. And as always, thanks for watching. Jim, the guy needs a fat farm.